There's a little bit of snow here. Oh, good night. Oh, where's the shovel now? So it's fluffy snow this morning, not heart attack snow. Hey, quit fighting. Quit fighting. Oh, goodness. The things I don't really care for doing is doing this long deck here. But anyways, it is what it is. We're gonna go at it. Oh, it's kind of cleaned up there a little bit now. But it's still snowing, so I don't want to get too energetic. So, how much snow did we get? I don't know. A lot. I'm supposed to have a dentist appointment this morning. I'm not sure if we're going to venture out or not. One of the uh, things I uh, am a little concerned about is the baby calves here. Just want to make sure that they're healthy and. They're definitely out of the wind. Stay. Cows are finding a just a spot to well, there's not much snow over here. This is nice. Hello chickens! So there's no point of getting the snowblower going now. I'm gonna wait for all the snow to come down. They still, looks like we still got another seven, eight hours of snow to come. So it's just what, what they're forecasting. Stupid forecasters. Oh my goodness. Right around the buildings there isn't very much snow. I have to venture out today. I have a dentist appointment. Gonna leave a little bit earlier. The highway seemed to be fair, so I think we'll uh, I'll give that a whirl. That's one thing the cats know. You guys know where to go, hey? Nice soft. We are venturing out. Got a dentist appointed this morning in an hour and 15 minutes, and we've had about eight inches of snow. And uh, usually the roads do get better on our way out. We can continue to make it. I'll just keep it between the. If you can see anything, I'll keep it in between the uh, pegs there. air conditioning. Our friends in Tennessee are saying it's so warm out there. Oh, there's a big snow drift here. Oh, let's see. We might not make it. <laughs> let's go. I have a different opinion because I know I have a, a feeling that knee has been cracked for a number of months right now. It's not affecting me badly, so but uh, I know that it's going to be costing some money to fix. That's why we get annual checkups so I don't have to have false teeth from a cow. A cow. Hello, neighbors. We're not the only track here. Look at that. There's a track there already. Somebody has made a track. Wonderful. As long as they stayed out of the ditch. Look at that. It's not, and it's not a deer track. Look at this. We're home free. The dead is. Uh, would have been a little bit wider. Yeah, maybe. The dentist, here we come. The dentist, here we come. Hi ho, the dentist. Here we come.
the dentist, here we come. The dentist, here we come. I hold the dentist, here we come to clean our teeth. We go to clean our teeth. Asking myself that question for 53 years already. Well, maybe not 53 years, maybe the later, latter years. But it's been very good with you in my life. <laughs> good save, honey, good save. <laughs> There's a little bit of snow here, boys and girls. Goodness gracious, boy. Oh, there's some snow here. I hope it doesn't blow and we might not be able to get back in. Get in the ditch. Please. We can't get in the ditch because look at that snowbank over there. breakfast so we're coming up the highway there has been a few tracks uh, so it's I didn't have to break trail all the way and we're up to the highway now and the highway is clear the plows have gone over usually when we get to this highway it's always uh, clear it's snow covered but uh, it's gonna be clear sailing now all the way to town well we've made 36 miles we've passed one vehicle already we're going to pass number two already. Look at this. This guy has had enough. He's <laughs> taking his camper. He's had enough. He's, had He's getting out of here. Are we going the wrong way? Yes. Our fire is back that way. Our fireplace. Our hot coffee. It's back there. Yeah, it's not the same out of a travel boot. Somebody's going to do some snow clearing. I have two fillies that need to be repaired. And there's a waiting list and it uh, is July 4th when I'll be able to get them fixed. I'll get both of them fixed. Joyce guys has a clean bill of clean teeth now. No cavities. 
Anyways, heading back home. What I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna put a bale of hay in that round bale feeder there. And I'm gonna take this, this is kind of slew hay. We're gonna spread that all around so the cattle have a spot where they can actually, uh, won't have snow. That's gonna probably soak up throughout the day and the night. And then I'm gonna take the twines off that one. We'll put it in a round bale feeder someplace there. So let's get going. some of this hay so that these calves can uh, actually be nice and comfortable here have a nice dry spot and then the cows can be comfortable too I've got a spot here just the calves can go not the cows because the calves don't really seem to uh, get the, their spots really wet because they're not that uh, they're lighter animals <clears throat> so this will work pretty good uh, for today I'm sure this is all gonna soak up this snow because it is mild underneath and uh, just uh, just want to make sure the animals are comfortable here uh, from the storm here because one of the one of the bad things that could actually happen some of these calves get sick and they could get really get diarrhea we call it uh, scours I don't think anything ever had any scour guard here calves are healthy right now it's cheaper for me to put a bale of uh, slew hay in here let them be all dry and we're supposed to get some uh, nice weather coming up here uh, like even today it's actually you can see it's melting off the roof it's melting here hey hey buddy what you doing saying hi to everybody come by that's it walk up uh, that's not what I want she's gonna come by lie down lie down walk up Walk up, out of boy. Well, I guess the wind was strong enough. It uh, knocked down one of the portable windbreaks where the bulls are. Bulls are over there. I'm not going to worry about that portable windbreak today. Uh, it's not going anywhere. I'll deal with that tomorrow. It's going with the tractor. There is uh, going to probably be a little bit of a challenge. I might even uh, blow a road out there. We'll see how that goes. But. Anyways, we're just uh, just coming in from the uh, big herd. I brought them around bale of silage there. So I wanted to check up on them since I was going there. Might as well uh, take a bale with me. And I also made a track over there as well. We're blowing in. Well, today is the next day after the big April storm we had. And uh, I cleared out the yard yesterday and uh, it snowed overnight probably about another inch, but uh, I'm not really too concerned. The driveway behind me, I cleared that yesterday. It was running up. I don't think I have to go through it uh, again, but uh, what I have noticed that uh, wherever it's a little bit dark, uh, the sun is getting onto it and it's actually melting. It's, uh... Well, I'm going out to, to rescue. Actually, I'm gonna go rescue one of the home care workers that's making their way here. I guess they got stuck. So what I need to do is, uh, she called and I figured I'll give her a hand and um, roads are terrible right now here with this storm we got. I know the plows are doing the best they can to clear the roads, but uh, yeah, it's not fun. And so this is our country road right now. I was here about an, an hour ago and so I'm just gonna take it slow here so I can stay on the frozen the track here. I don't wanna get off of it. I know there's about three hydro poles that it's not very healthy. Yeah, there's no way anybody's making a hit here with a car. Well, the snowplow's coming, 
That's a good thing. Well, I have a pet peeve. These manufacturers, North America or overseas, North America or overseas, you should not be selling a car without a tow hook in the back or in the front. You should have something that you hook up. That's ridiculous. So anyways, that's all I have to say. So that lady was coming to help my mom and uh, so she can't make it, not with these kind of road conditions. Anyway, she's, uh, we're well on our way home. Hey Arnie, is there a lot of snow? Whoa, <laughs> oh, that'll pick things up. Leave the cat alone.